Sorry it's been such a long time since my last video. About seven months ago, I think. Okay. Well, here's my next one. Hi, everybody. Right. Now, what I've got here is my um, Epsom salt battery conversion from uh, lead acid um, battery. Uh, now I've been having problems charging it. I've tried all sorts over the weekend and now thanks to Kyle whose link up on the bottom of this video um, the charge is going up quite nicely. I couldn't get above 8.83 .8 before <coughs> and uh, I checked it after an hour's charging this, in this way which I'll explain in a minute and um, it's as you can see uh, the 11 going out on up I was jumped up to 12 now and I can only think of the fact that it's uh, settling the salts in the liquid. It was um, it was ten spoonfuls of uh, Epsom salts, and um, then it was uh, topped up with uh, ionized water, and the whole solution was stirred until the, the salts um, dissipated into the liquid, and then poured into each cell. Um, I don't know exactly what's going on in the battery because uh, this is what I gleaned from another YouTuber um, again I'll put the link to his channel underneath but uh, yeah it's uh, going very well now what um, Kyle said in uh, his video was um, that have the power supply of 15 volts at 2 amps if I turn the power supply off a moment, you can see the 15 volts and the uh, it's uh, short circuit uh, set to 2 amps. So it's pumping 199 into the battery at the moment, which is brilliant, which is more than I was getting over the weekend. Right, well I'll uh, leave it at that for now. There's the voltage now. And the battery does not get as hot as it does with this charger, a bog standard battery charger, lead acid battery charger. So, thank you, Kyle. This is brilliant, it's working well, and uh, I'm over the moon. Right, talk to you all of you soon. Bye.